So I'm definitely going to tell you, I think these two iPhones are pretty much completely unmatched as of right now. Now these two iPhones are the iPhone 11 Pro and the iPhone 11 Pro Max. Now the iPhone 11 Pro Max I have here does have a crack back, which is very interesting because my 11 Pro that I have here, I used from 2019 to 2020, and I loved this iPhone a lot. The color was beautiful, the feeling of this phone was beautiful, and I really do think for the next few years, maybe the iPhone 14s will prove me wrong, but I definitely do think for the next few years, the iPhone 11 Pro series, including the 11 Pro Max, is probably going to be one of the most unmatched iPhones in general. These devices Apple made are future-proofed in so many different ways, and when I look at these two devices, the 11 Pro and 11 Pro Max side by side, I think these devices are beautiful, I think they have a ton of capability, and I'm super excited about the future of both these iPhones. Now, the one thing I wanna hit on is the body. As I always mention, Apple did a tremendous job with this type of design, and even when you look at it right here, I mean, just look at how beautiful this phone looks. I mean, you have that triple camera setup, which is that in and of itself is amazing you have this beautiful rose gold color that i loved so much or that standard gold color i forgot what they called it frosted glass back beautiful display i guess my phone is dead right now 5.8 inch super retina xdr oled panel and this phone looked beautiful but i love the fact that apple also really focused in on their pro max as well previously on their 10s max i think they kind of dropped the ball in some areas i feel like they could have done a little bit of a better job but the fact that they put a bigger size battery on this thing and they really focused in on that criteria i think they did a tremendous job in that standpoint and i do think when i look at this you know iphone and i look at the future of this device I still think the future of these iPhones are incredible. Now what's super crazy was that, like how I mentioned before, Apple dropped Apple dropped iOS 16 and I think it's a great update. It brought a lot of cool things about this new lock screen and everything like that. But what was very interesting was the iPhone 11 Pros, these two devices got a ton of features within iOS 16, which makes me really, really happy. And I would say almost every single feature that came within iOS 16 came for these devices. Now, when I look at the future of these iPhones, I think Apple set a really good precedent for these iPhones. I don't think they did a good one for the iPhone 10s and you know the iPhone surrounding those ones. But the 11 Pro, the fact that they kind of, you know, didn't mention these iPhones by name, and the fact that the iPhones below these, which are the XS and XS Max, the fact that the fact that those ones got a ton of features cut out, but these iPhones kept their features, makes me think that these iPhones, in my opinion, are probably going to last much longer than a lot of people think. So because of that, I think these devices in and of itself are completely unmatched for the most part. And I think for the future of these devices, they're going to be in a really good spot. Are they perfect? No. But I do think when we look at the future of these devices, probably in the next like few years, we're going to look back at these phones and we're going to be like, wow, these iPhones, I mean, there weren't really too many other iPhones that matched up as well as these things did. The 11 Pro and 11 Pro Max, Apple did a great job with. And honestly, I hope they make another iPhone like these in the future that were this great probably in the next few years to come. So that kind of covers it up. If you have any other thoughts or questions, please let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button. That means so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.